Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Good afternoon, students. Thank you for your participation during the class. In this video, I'm going to summarize uh, lesson number 4.9, song lyrics. So uh, we have uh, read and understood uh, in detail about uh, the Johnny Mitchell, that uh, she was a songwriter, a Canadian singer and songwriter as well. And uh, here I'm going to show you the answers of uh, these questions below, as you can see here. Question number one, uh, read the lyrics and listen to the song online. It was popular when it came out and it's still popular today. Why do you think it is? So uh, as I ask you this question, that uh, big yellow taxi, uh, it is a song that was written, recorded by the Johnny uh Micha, like in 1970 so why this song is still uh, popular um because of its lyrics right uh, uh, she experienced uh, on her first trip to hawaii and uh, she took a taxi to the hotel and woke up next morning and flew back to the curtain and saw these beautiful green mountains in the distance then she looked down and there was a parking lot as far as uh, the eye could see. And broke my heart. This light on paradise. That's why she wrote this song and this song touched the hearts of the people, many people. Question number two here, answer these questions about the language of the song. A, B, C and uh, D, All right. Let's see. Here you can see A, uh, doesn't it always seem to go? It's isn't it always the way put them in a tree museum? C is second and fourth lines, and uh, each verse rhyme slam and man is a half line, and then D, uh, you can see here, uh, paragraph one, three, five, and seven are the verses that chores is repeated after each verse. All right, so how that you can trying to see uh, the question E that at the end of uh, the song, why do you think Johnny Mitchell repeats the line? They paved paradise and put a pot in a lot. That's it, because she was standing on the uh, window and uh, looking at this old scene through the window. Answer these questions about the meaning and purpose of the song A, B, and C. Does the song have a message? If so, so what is it? Then question B and C. Let's see answers. All right, fine, that's it. And so, uh, so then if you take a look at uh, the question number three, does the song have a message of so, so what is it? After reading the song, uh, here, Big Yellow Taxi, you can easily answer all these questions. Let us read the song. They paved paradise and put up a parking lot with the pink hotel, a boutique, and swinging hot spot. Don't it always seem to go that I don't know what you, will, what you have got till it's gone. They paved paradise and put it put up a parking lot. They took all the trees and put them in a tree museum and they charged the people a dollar and a half just to see them. In town, it always seemed to go that you don't know what you have got till it's gone. They paved paradise and 
put up parking lot. Hey, farmer, farmer, put away the DDT now. Um, let us see here, actually, the notes. Um, if you take a look on the right side, so you will get the details that the Royal Hawaiian Hotel, Waikiki, Hawaii, is uh, thought to be the pink hotel described in this song here in this first part, right? The tree museum is thought to be the foster botanical garden in the Honolulu where you pay to see uh, trees and plants. 1940s and 50s, uh, farmers began using DDT to protect their crops from insects. So it is no longer used in the most countries because it is an environmental poison, affecting not only insects, birds, fish and humans. Uh, it is still used in US in 1970 when Johnny Mitchell wrote this song. Johnny Mitchell doesn't say why the big yellow taxi has come to take away her old man, which can mean her partner or father. She leaves us to guess. So, after reading this song, the lyrics that you can uh, answer, that does the song have a message? So, so what was it? So, here we have seen that the usage of D, D, T, uh, um, which was not good for the environment. She highlighted that. And why do you think that Johnny Mitchell wrote this song? She was just standing there uh, in the pink hotel um, and she got the idea of these lyrics. What is the difference between writing a pop song about this topic and writing an essay an article in a magazine? There is actually a difference. Uh, the rhyming words are the difference. The songs, the poems, are usually have the rhyming words at hand, right? But the articles uh, do not have the rhyming words, right? So uh, that is it. And uh, I'll see you in your next class. Uh, take good care of yourself. And good luck.